Prove that 1 minus cos square a of secant square a is equal to tan square a. We know that 1 minus cos square a is equal to sin square a. Then secant square a is equal to 1 by cos square a. The LHS side. LHS you are having 1 minus cos square a into secant square a. 1 minus cos square a is replaced by sin square a into secant square a is replaced by 1 by cos square a. Sin square a into 1 is sin square a by cos square a. Sin by cos square is tan square a. Because sin a by cos a is equal to tan a. Second main, prove that secant a minus 1 divided by secant a plus 1 is equal to 1 minus cos a by 1 plus cos a. So your secant a is equal to 1 by cos a. We know that secant a is equal to 1 by cos a. LHS secant a minus 1 divided by secant a plus 1 this can be written as 1 by cos a minus 1 divided by 1 by cos a plus 1 taking LCM here cos a will be the LCM 1 minus cos a into 1 is cos a here again the denominator cos a will be the LCM in the numerator we are having 1 plus cos a equals 1 minus cos a by cos a into taking this one numerator it becomes cos a by 1 plus cos a so cos a cos a cancels and you are left out with 1 minus cos a by 1 plus cos a this is RHS 1 plus sin a 1 plus sin a divided by 1 minus sin a is equal to cosecant a plus cosecant a plus 1 divided by cosecant a minus 1 1 plus sin a by 1 minus sin a divide by sin a in numerator and denominator so if it is divided by sin a 1 by sin a plus sin a by sin a 1 by sin a minus sin a by sin a so here sin a sin a cancels here one sin a sin a cancels one. One by sin a is cosecant a plus sin a sin a cancels and it will be one. Here one by sin a is cosecant a minus one. This is RHS. And NHS third question. One upon tan a plus cot a is equal to sin a cos a. Here it is one upon tan a plus cot a is equal to 1 by tan can be written as sin a by cos a plus cot can be written as cos a by sin a take the LCM here here cos a sin a will be the LCM in the denominator cos a into sin a then sin a into sin a sin a into sin a is sin square a plus cos a into cos a is cos square a 1 into take this whole thing to the numerator it becomes cos a into sin a divided by sin square a plus cos square a because cos square a plus sin square a is equal to 1 so sin a into cos a is sin a cos a by 1. This is RHS. Fourth question. Tan a minus cot a is equal to 1 minus 2 cos square a by sin a cos a. LHS. Tan a minus cot a. Tan a can be done as sin a by cos a 
cot a can be written as cos a by sin a take the lcm lcm you will be getting cos a into sin a as lcm sin a into sin a is sin square a minus cos a into cos a is cos square a we know that sin square a is equal to 1 minus cos square a replace sin square a as 1 minus cos square a right minus cos square a as it is divided by cos a into sin a right as it is so 1 here minus cos square a and minus cos square a both are minus add add and you have to put minus sign minus cos 2 cos square a both terms are minus both are minus you should add and you have to put minus so 1 minus 2 cos square a divided by cos a into sin a can be done as sin a into cos a this is RHS third main LHS 1 plus sin a by 1 minus sin a rationalizing the rationalizing the denominator <coughs> so rationalizing the denominator means you have to multiply by 1 plus sin a and also you have to divide it by 1 plus sin a because in the denominator you are having 1 minus sin a so 1 plus sin a into 1 plus sin a becomes 1 plus sin a whole square by a minus b to a plus b becomes 1 square minus sin square a a minus b to a plus b becomes a square minus b square so that is equal to 1 square is 1 minus sin square a so again under square root 1 plus sin a whole square 1 minus sin square is cos square a square square root square square root cancels and we will be having 1 plus sin a by cos a so this can be written in this form 1 by cos a plus sin a by cos a 1 by cos a is secant a plus sin a by cos a is tan a this is RHS a minus b of a plus b equals a square minus b square third question second question again lhs equal to square root of 1 minus cos a by 1 plus cos a rationalizing the denominator your 1 plus cos a is there so that you have to multiply by 1 minus cos a divided by 1 minus cos a the numerator will be getting 1 minus cos a whole square In the denominator you are having 1 plus cos a into 1 minus cos a that is equal to 1 minus cos square a again because a plus b of a minus b equals a square minus b square this is equal to 1 minus cos a whole square right as it is divided by 1 minus cos square a is sin square a square 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 root cancels 1 minus cos a by sin a 1 by sin a minus cos a by sin a 1 by sin a is cosecant a minus cos by sin is cot a or just
थर्ड क्वेश्चन थर्ड मेन थर्ड क्वेश्चन अंडर रूट ऑफ वन बाइन साइन ए बाय वन प्लस साइन ए इक्वल्स टू कॉस ए बाय वन प्लस साइन ए ये रैशनलाइज the numerator lhs 1 minus sin a by 1 plus sin a rational is the numerator here you are having 1 minus sin a so that you have to multiply by 1 plus sin a and once you have to divide it by 1 plus sin a One minus sine into one plus sine will be having one square minus sine square a. A plus b of a minus b equals a square minus b square. Again, here in the denominator we are having one plus sine a whole square. One minus sine square is cos square a. Then this is right as it is in the denominator 1 plus sin a whole square 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 it cancels and will be having cos a by 1 plus sin a this is RHS. Fourth one without using trigonometric tables show that tan 10 degrees tan 10 degrees into tan 15 degrees into tan 75 degrees into tan 80 degrees equals to 1. LHS tan 10 degrees into tan 80 degrees into tan 15 degrees into tan 75. First, you have to arrange in this way. Then tan 80, tan 10 degrees, you write as it is. Tan 80 can be written as into tan of 90 degree minus 10 degree into right tan 15 degrees as it is tan of 75 can be done as tan 75 degrees tan of 90 degree minus 15 degrees tan 10 degree right as it is into tan of 90 minus 10 degrees cot 10 degree into tan 15 degree right as it is tan of 90 minus 15 can be done as cot 15 degrees tan 10 degree right as it is cot can be written as 1 by tan 10 degrees into tan 15 degrees right as it is into cot 15 can be written as 1 by tan 15 so all cancels here and it is left with 1. This is RHS. Second question. Sin 42 into secant 48 plus cos 42 into cosecant 48. LHS. Sin 42 degrees into secant 48 degrees plus cos 42 degrees into cosecant 48 degrees. Write sin 42 as it is secant 90 minus 42 degrees. Secant 48 can be written as secant of 90 minus 42 degrees plus cos 42 degrees. Write as it is cosecant of 90 minus 42 degrees is equal to 48 then sin 42 into secant 90 minus uh, 42 is cosecant 42 plus cos 42 is equal to 
cosecant 90 minus 42 is secant 42 degrees then sin 42 into cosecant is 1 by sin 42 plus cos 42 into secant is 1 by cos 42 this this cancels this and this cancels will be having 1 plus 1 which is equal to 2 or LHS third question fourth main third question sin 26 degree divided by secant 64 degree plus cos 26 degree divided by cosecant 64 degree is equal to 1 LHS sin 26 degree secant 64 degrees plus cos 26 degrees divided by cosecant 64 degrees sin 26 degrees right as it is secant 64 can be written as secant 90 minus 26 degrees plus cos 26 right as it is cosecant 64 cosecant of 90 minus 26 degrees write sin 26 in the numerator as it is secant 90 minus 26 is cosecant 26 degrees cos 26 degrees right as it is cosecant 90 minus 26 is secant 26 degrees sin 26 right as this in the numerator in the denominator cosecant 26 degree is there replace it by 1 by sin 26 degree plus here cos 26 degree right as it is secant 26 can be written as 1 by cos 26 degrees then taking to the numerator it becomes reciprocal sin 26 degrees into sin 26 degrees plus cos 26 degrees into cos 26 degree divided by 1 which is equal to sin 26 degree into sin 26 degrees sin square 26 cos into cos is cos square 26 degrees so trigonometric identity first identity which is equal to 1 this is RHS Thank you.